location there. And uh, let's go. Yeah. All right. What y'all, uh, I don't know, that was a weak ass start, huh? Yeah, it was like super low energy. <laughs> you know, you know, hey you, guys, you know, I, you know, I'm about that high energy. I'm definitely, uh, I had a, I, I'm a little hungover, I guess. I, I ain't, um, I ain't hung, not, not like the, uh, Two two weeks ago, where I was I was fucked um, up when nothing was working and I couldn't get uh, none of this shit was working. It was it was a bad pod, but uh, I'm definitely hungover. I can tell you that. Yeah, yeah. We 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 uh we promised to have a good pod for you guys. Happy Saturday. Nice weather in the city. Ninety two degrees. At least yeah, you know today is Saturday. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I, it's, it's been Saturday two days in a row for me. Uh, <laughs> yeah, up yesterday, talking about so you gonna be there at three. I'm like. Damn, okay. I thought it was we was doing this. He's like, I do it. I do two pods. Yeah. Fuck it. Like, Friday, what's the topics Saturday? for this one? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> he said, What's the topics for this one? I'm like, I said it above. He was like, I thought that was for Saturday. I was like, Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what, what are we talking about? It's Saturday, nigga. Like, what the fuck? Uh the voice you're hearing is B Shine. We got uh the brother B Shine with us, man. What's going on, people? How y'all doing? How y'all doing? The infamous. The infamous B Shine. Infamous. Infamous. Yeah, infamous. <laughs> infamous. Yeah, infamous. Infamous. Yeah, yeah. infamous. <laughs> that nigga said infamous. Yeah, infamous. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right. Respect it. Right. 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 You know. In, infamous. So you should have had, uh, s- man, shook ones. You know what I'm saying? Queued up. Yeah, yeah, you know yeah. what I'm if I'd have known. If I'd have known. Or, you know what I'm saying? The in- infamous. Or, yeah. uh, you know what I'm saying? Keep it, keep it Chicago. Has some Shauna and Tifa. Oh, oh, infamous yeah, yeah. syndicate pulled up, you know what I'm saying? I got that right here. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Hold on, hold yeah. on. Hold on. Yeah. Wait, wait a second. Wait a second. Tell me what you're doing. Yeah, I see it. I see it right hey, there. There you go. One of the craziest beefs in rap music ever. Yeah, tell him about ever. it. Ever. Give, give, so, give, give, give him a... Just briefly, it was just really simple. It was just, you know, they called themselves Infamous Mob Deep and took disrespect to them calling themselves the Infamous Syndicate to the point Mob Deep didn't come to Chicago for years. Of for some, years, for some ladies, <laughs> for years, they didn't come to. Well, they, well, I won't say that. They, I'm sure they came, but they didn't come perform. They didn't. They wouldn't. They didn't do no shows. It was a good amount of time, just because of infamous. Because they, they were, they weren't just mob deep. They were the infamous mob deep. Mm. So that they really had beef with them. Infamous. And people's well, gonna call themselves infamous. And people is like, you got beef with two women. It's infamous syndicate. Infamous. They're not. They're not the same. It's two different mob deep. So rest, in peace, rest in peace, rest in peace, prodigy. Yeah, rest in peace, prodigy. Crazy. Uh, <laughs> this nigga uh, is sitting in for Javen because Javen is in Vegas for the Morgan Park 25th reunion. Oh, that's uh, what it was. Yeah, that's nah, what I thought it just went just. No, nah, that nigga. You know. Well, hey, that's not what I thought. I thought you know. You need a call. Oh, you, I you thought need. he got flew down. You know what I'm saying? He got flew Yeah, he got flew out. He kind of did. Yeah, he kind of did. He kind of did. He still kind of did. He still kind of did. He got flew out. I wonder if he going to bust down. He going to bust down. He in Vegas. Of course he is. He going to bust down. Of course he is. You think his rates going to change? Still $40. Still, yeah, yeah. No, that's Javen. He's going to go 45, 73. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 That'd be some type of odd ass like, numbers. You know, I got to gamble. The thirst, <laughs> hey, the thirst trap work, man. Yeah, no. <laughs> Dude, Transformers. Who would have thought? Who would have thought? <laughs> nigga, maybe we should start. Right. We laughing at right, nigga. This nigga gone. Right. Right. <laughs> right. That nigga, he made. But when he watch it, he going to have some heat for y'all ass when he get back. Yeah, yeah, well, yeah. I, well, yeah. I pack whatever. Yeah, yeah. Whatever. yeah. 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 I'm, I'm ready for it. That's, that's the point. We're going to have fun, nigga. I got to give you some ammo. Um, so let's get started, man. What y'all want to what, what start with, man? We can uh, intro this thing. This is episode 136 of the A Lot Podcast. Uh, yeah, yeah, Javen. But it's too hot to fuck. But, uh, and me, me and Mod and Brian, man. We're going to. It's definitely hot in Chicago. So. Yeah, sure. And if y'all in y'all jobs and at y'all cubicles and shit, it'd be cold at work. And it's like hot outside. You go outside for lunch and catch a cold down there. Yeah, some shit. It is so fucking. Like, you go outside instantly, start sweating. It's muggy. Yeah. Muggy. I don't like that muggy, humid ass weather. Shout out Tony Baines, man. This is my favorite track from this nigga because it is basically our lives. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Summer days I'm rolling up. Out and back I'm grilling up. Throw a post up, yo, what's up? Now it's people pulling up. Summer dresses, that's what's up. Creases through your cheeks and such. Paper planes and plenty blunts. Yo, what the fuck else could you want? Struggle place, now that ain't us. No, no, that ain't us. Music playing, girls displaying pretty parts I like to touch. Pretty yes, sir. So look at those. Ladies barely 
Jamie and Jamie back here. This is Jamie back here. The memory. What is this? He literally those three men at the beginning uh, from, uh, you know what I'm saying, when yeah. they were sitting on the curb. What was yeah. that dude right there? Mm-hmm. The motherfucker sitting on the curb. Yeah, right. that's, that's all Javen Backyard is now. A <laughs> whole bunch of curmudgeons back there like, what? This new music. Hey. I hate these young you niggas. You know what it was like in 2005? <laughs> boy, me and Randall was, boy, we was killing it in our heyday. We was tossing bitches over the balcony. Uh, yeah. Should have um, worn my love sundress season if I knew he was gonna play this. <laughs> yeah, sun, sundress season kind of failed me a little bit. Though. Yeah, I mean maybe it's the monkey pot, so I don't know. All, all they want to wear is they need to pop them monkeys. Suits. <laughs> they just want to wear wrestling suits and, and and got the camel toe out. They don't even want to show their ass. They want he said the, the wrestling toe. suits, wrestling. the singlets. They do be yeah, having those yeah, singlets. Yeah, yeah. They be wearing the uh, the uh, Andre the Giant joints. Right, with the one, <laughs> yeah, across the boob. Well, y'all yeah, want to start, man? We got a lot of shit to discuss, man. There's a lot of shit that happened this week, man. Yeah, you know, you too, but you know how it go, man. How was your week? Oh shit. Well, it was a short week for me because I thought it was. <laughs> <laughs> no, but it, it was a good week, man. I, uh, Javen Palooza happened. Went to the, uh, went to that. That shit was uh, dope. Got some good advice from Mike G, as always. Um, I had fucking squirrels in the attic and shit. I'm went, you know, I went the trade route. Go to a person that do this shit. He like twelve hundred dollars. I tell Mike G, he like, boy, you want to go to Home Depot and get you some cat? So what he said, coyote piss? I'm like they got that? Like they just sell? Yeah, that's some strange shit that I didn't know they. Sell I went and bought piss. that shit and squirted it. First of all, my dumb ass. It's on. It's in the attic, so I'm hanging out the window trying to shoot the shit, and this wind blowing. It's urine. <laughs> Shit so you, stinks you, like a motherfucker. So you like, spraying yourself with coyote pits. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Uh, it's like <laughs> you learned this when you was like seven. Don't pee in the wind. Uh, and here I am with somebody uh, else. Piss. You spraying yeah, pee yeah, in the wind. Yeah, let's yeah, shit that. I'm trying to hit it all where I think. I'm like, oh, they be over there. That shit coming back. I'm like, oh. <laughs> I just put that shit down, wash my hands, and quit. I'm like, I I spray it again when I hear him. I ain't finna. I'm fucking up. <laughs> I'm fucking up. Like a baby over there, like. <laughs> Get back! I ain't no use behind me. Close. Oh. So everybody, <laughs> everybody covered in coyote piss. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then good I, I tell, uh, I tell my G what happened. He like, no, that's not how you do it at all. Like you're supposed to get out on the roof, put gloves on. I didn't do nothing. I popped the thing right off, like, yeah. like it's Windex, nigga. Like this. Yeah, like you, like you spraying some raid around the house. Yeah. So that shit is uh And then, nah, I ain't even tell you that. Well, I sprayed it. Uh, of course, it's supposed to be used outside. But it was like this one little piece that I'm like, I'm, nigga, that shit stank like I'm gonna still stink. Like it's been 92. Then, then it had the nerve. It was 100 degrees the next day. <laughs> My whole house stank. <laughs> like nigga, not in the inside, but like when I'm walk, I'm in the backyard. Like, what the fuck is that? That's that coyote piss cooking. Just cooking. It's just cooking. cooking. That like, shit is nigga. marinating your <laughs> marinating your fucking ass. Yeah, so. <laughs> So that's that's how my week went, man. I was fighting squirrels. Oh, I think I won, but I, I, I surely lost. Nigga, they, I know I lost, but I, I might have also won. But oh I, man, that probably was a squirrel yeah. sitting in the tree, man. Look at this nigga, man. Well, my motherfucking week was my my week was boring up until I want to say what Thursday. I made a post, and then it was a it was, everybody that was black understood the joke. But because the person in it, the, what was the joke? The, the, well, the, the okay, let me explain it to the people. Okay, I made a post to where it was a, a brightly colored frog, and I, it was a, a, a white lady with the exact same hair. And the top of the post said pretty much, uh, in nature, uh, toxic venomous animals show themselves with bright colors. So that was the joke. It was more of a joke about that. that. I definitely yeah, saw that. It's, it's a joke about yeah. the toxicity of certain type of women. Or animals. Well, was, well no, it was more <laughs> that, no, it's, well, it, using the animal as an analog right, for right, the, right, right, the, right. the women. But I, didn't, I talk shit about women all the time, but I guess because I used a white woman's face. And not only was it a white woman, but uh, possibly non-binary, the LGBTQIAA+. Plus Type person. You did that really well. I, I, you, know, you, got, you got all the letters. <laughs> so I ain't never. Know. Usually people stop at the Q. They be like, you plus. <laughs> that nigga said I A A. And you know, shit. It went from all of the black people laughing, the black women <laughs> with colored hair, they posting their hair, saying fuck me, but we're laughing and joking. And next thing you know, I have an influx 
of Caucasian people that I have never seen before. I'm looking at their pages. It's nothing but but the was pride. It, you, it was you versus everybody, or did, did, did people come to your side? Come to uh, your no, head? not at first. It, 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 shit, it was I was damn near 500 comments in. So you got bullied, that. basically. They, no, they tried to bully me because what they wanted to do was bully me into removing the post. Uh, like it was a couple comments. They was like, "Oh, I'm surprised the comment section is still open." I'm like, did "I'm you, not gonna did turn you, it off." Did you share that picture, or you saved it to your uh, phone and then posted it back? I on? saved it to my phone and then I posted. So it, it looked like it's your picture. Yeah, so it looked like it's mine. Uh, they 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 going hard about it. Um, Why they, they just get, report it? I mean, it, cause cause obviously it's not obviously it's nothing that can be taken down just from a report. Just because you don't like everything, don't mean that Facebook gonna take everything down. Shit. <laughs> and what they wanted to do was to bully the fuck out of me. Like, oh, yeah, we're gonna we're just going to keep bullying. Like, they didn't move on to other posts. And it's like... Did it, did, it, did it stay in the conversation or did it go to, like, name calling? And all oh, no. Nah, well, you know, they, you know, I can tell they wanted to call me the N-word with the hard R. <laughs> but, you know, you they, say they, they, they just, they just wanted nigga. to... You they just, No, but they, they wanted to say nigger. They wanted to... Nigger. Nigger. Emphasize. Nigger. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Like, and it's like, emphasize. And it's like, like all Steve they kept... Kirk. Right. You know, and all they kept saying <laughs> no, was, oh, son, thanks, thanks for letting us know you a predator. Thanks for letting you know... My bad. Thanks for letting us know you a predator. That's the reason why I changed my profile pick to the predator. Mm. So you want to troll me? I'll troll you motherfuckers back. You know, I, like I kept. So how are you them. a predator for, for just saying? Oh no, because I said that. Also, I said you know. I guess that's you why I'm also, not. A, I see. <laughs> also, I, I said that uh, I'm not. A, I'm, that's maybe that's the reason why I'm not attracted to women with all these different color hair. Because I'm talking about again that how some women show their. Toxic. You don't like none of that shit. Some of that should be hot. I mean, some of it, yeah, but not for everybody. And some of that shit. I'm, you know what I like? I like a. Uh, Maybe because my mom has always had a little haircut. But, like, when they do, like, the color and, like, a, and a one, you know, they get the, like, the one fade, and they might have, like, the little parts on the side, and they might be, like... Right. It, for me, it depends on the colors. And yeah, I like, can't do, like, that purple and green Yeah, you shit. know, and yeah, it, yeah. It, I mean, it, but for some women, yeah, it, it fits Yeah, go them. with they, they skin but, tone. But I'm sorry. For, for me, I like a naturally looking woman, and it's like... Man, I just love a woman with their either you can have your fro if you got the shit laid down, but nice black hair, or you know, depending on how you look, maybe blonde, depending on your. Uh, but some people color. like that. So how are you gonna talk about people that don't like it? Shit, how are they gonna talk about me because I don't like it? So I mean, what yeah, the I fuck? Guess you're right. <laughs> shit, yeah. really, everybody has their preferences. I'm not really in the. But really why do we list them? Huh? Like, if I think that's understood, everybody knows we. I think everybody would agree we all have our own preferences. Mm -hmm. So why do we? Shame people for their purposes if we know everybody has their or, own. Or even better, why do we talk about the shit we don't like so much? Well, yeah, why is it even? Why you do we even talk like, about it? Yeah, you know what I'm saying? The, like, why is it on if your? If you don't like some shit, it's like whatever. That should be a so, one sentence thing. I don't like. Yeah, that. I don't like that. I mean, that's all yeah. I said. I said I don't like that. And apparently, because I don't like that, everybody. Why, has I a guess what I'm saying. Why do you have to list or let people know that you don't like it? What's, what's, the, I, what's, I, what's I, the point of telling people that? Hey, what I you can, don't like? I can see if you date this person. The same. The same way. You have a point to say the things you like. You should have the same ability to say the things you don't like. You don't always have to only speak positively all the time. You don't always have to speak negatively. But why but, give energy to something that you don't like? Right. You yeah. don't like it. Yeah. So but, why give energy? The thing to you do like, you trying to attract it. So you are trying to put it out in the universe to be like, hey, I hope I win a million dollars. You're never gonna be like, God, I hope I don't lose a thousand dollars. You just, you just keep, you know what I'm saying? I, you I, just but, operate but, like but that. I, I'm one of those people that I will wish for that million dollars and I will stay. I hope I don't lose this thousand dollars. You know, everybody has but you, a different. But but, but you, but you will you will say that to somebody? Like you will be like, man, like because nine times ten, you ain't gonna even tell somebody you got a thousand dollars in your pocket. So to be like, man, I hope I don't lose this thousand dollars. Motherfuckers like, not everybody in the room know you got a thousand dollars. So you don't, really, Shit, you don't really, you know what I'm saying? I mean, well, I got a pistol on me, so I ain't worried about them knowing I got a thousand dollars. But I'm just saying in the in the conversation. I mean, of it how just, we it just talk. I mean, uh, going off your analogy, it just I was I would say that if depending on how the conversation is going. Okay. You know what I'm saying? I, that wouldn't be a, a conversation starter. Right, 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 it was clearly it was. Well, I mean, well, <laughs> shit, that, well that's with, with what I posted. Yeah, I mean, shit. I like to, I like to say certain things. I, I, I don't. I, my thing is, I, I don't like. I didn't read through all the comments, I, I, and and now it's so many comments that the only the uh, I don't want to say the bad ones. You know what I'm saying? It's not mm -hmm. people that's driving the dialogue or having a conversation. I like to have a conversation. I like to see your point of view, my point. But like I said, when it goes to name calling, or, or you can't make your point, so you be like, you gay. Or you know, I, I did or, or it's like my, now the observation I do see is that um, a lot of these conversations are from single people, and I I realized that I, I used to be single having these conversations, but I realized when you're in a relationship, you don't even care about this. Like you really don't even. It'd be like I disagree. You like what you? So I mean, shit, when I was in a relationship, I still had these single conversations. 
because that's what I saw. That's what when I see those type of things, it was just like I would just speak on them. You mm-hmm. don't just you don't have to. I feel like a person that's single should have the same right to speak on the problems they see that people that's in relationships yeah, have. They do. The same way yeah. people in relationships should be able to speak on the problems that single people have. The thing is, the dialogue shouldn't cause an argument unless the, the statements and facts that are and truths that are being given is hurting your feelings. And on my post, the majority of that over a thousand comments were people showing their trauma. Okay. And that's why I just kept letting them know, like, man, your trauma's showing. I've, and I've actually that talked, is nigga therapy yeah, and, and, yeah infamous therapy mm-hmm. yeah, I've uh, actually talked to three of them in my inbox I've, I've turned three I've turned know. three of these 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 transgender people into friends oh well that's good I mean you, you're not uh, you know excluding yourself you know yeah, uh, being a, a bigot I, or whatever I've never, I've never actually had a problem with them and never talked about their ass this was like a, a misfire that went left but it's like fuck it. If y'all wanna, I'm the, I'm you pick the. I'll be your Huckleberry. Y'all wanna <laughs> fuck with me? I, I'm gonna fuck with you back. Before we get to your week of my uh, people asking what post the post is on. B Shine is on his uh, page. It's a picture of a purple frog and a white woman with purple hair. It has a thousand comments. You can go check it out. Hey, first uh, we don't know if that's a white woman. You know they. Just so be, look, it, hey, purple you know, frog, purple hair. Looks, check it out. It looks like a white woman. Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, shit, man, you know, normal week, move though, man, finally fucking move, man, that shit was, uh, to say that shit was fucking stressful, it's an understatement, I don't recommend, y'all two with two babies, the baby right, too? you know what I'm saying, right, that's what I'm saying, it was like, I don't recommend it, and anybody would sit there and say, duh, I wouldn't try to move and pack, well, yeah, we had movers, thinking? like, what the fuck was y'all thinking, not having a baby, you know what I'm saying? But we generally, and you know what I'm saying, don't always have like a babysitter on hand, especially for him. So it is what it is. But yeah, it was it was a process. But it's done. Still got some cleaning to do. It's nice to be in a nice, much bigger space. I bet. My daughter ran up and down that damn hallway. Jesus <laughs> Christ. She was speeding down that hallway. Loving the extra space. So that was good. That was pretty much it, man. Well, uh, y'all like it? Yeah, 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 man. It's just much more space. Like I said you go from twelve to two. It's a, it's a huge no, jump. You don't have no uh, not learning curve, but you know, like getting used to the career. But like the babies, they they. Went oh yeah, yeah, yeah. She just texted me asking about light switches and shit. Which turn? Yeah, because there's so many goddamn lights in that motherfucker. Like, which too. one? Like, which which yeah. is this? I'm trying to do, yeah, just yeah, flick them. Learn just, them. Just, yeah, just, I'm like keep flicking. Them. Keep, That's yeah. all I did. I just keep flicking the lights. Yeah, I figure it out. Button. Yeah, you figure it out. It'd be all right. As long as you ain't got no eject button. And look, she think she think go crazy too, cause it's like I literally ain't watched like four loads of clothes, kids shit. Now she like, damn, you really using this? Yeah, nigga, this this, this is what this shit is for. Yeah, yeah, uh-huh. yeah, yeah we shit. getting this shit now. Nah, we get moved this in going. The house. It was uh, they left they washing dry. I was using the shit out of that thing, <laughs> shit. Um, but yeah, where y'all want to start, man? We can get this shit hey, going. Don't you man. check your comments? I'm looking at uh, what is it, K Lisa? Yeah, well. she said that this. Oh hell no! This got to be like the misogynist, the misogyny Olympics. That's cool. Bill, Bill, Bill. Somebody bring up women's stat. I don't know <laughs> what that is. That I don't think I got that on the docket. I'll look and see if I got it. Uh, I, um, if y'all want to go right to that, uh, misogyny, mystical. That's beyond misogyny. Coming through the door with my dick in my hand. Yeah, that nigga boy, he has problems. You know the fucked up part? I haven't. You saw the meme that said, uh, "If you see mystical in the woods raping a bear, help the bear." <laughs> <laughs> the fucked up part. I think I'm probably the only person that hasn't even read up on what he didn't got in trouble for again. I saw it. I just rape, know, rape, yeah, rape. You don't need to know the details when they say rape. rape. I, why wouldn't I need to know the details? Because it's the third time. Oh, yeah, this it's is this is not the first time he's been to jail and got out. I don't need to know. <laughs> I don't no need no nothing. Like, the first time what? I'm kind of like, what happened? Like, yeah, it's crazy. Like, okay, all right. You you got to really make me understand this misunderstanding. Okay, second time, get the fuck away from. Me. Third time, and hey, fam, I, from I, a from a legal it. standpoint, it's one of the most difficult things to prove. It no, really, it yeah, really is. It, if it goes yeah, from from someone being at least charged to having Man, them found I, I, like I, I, that, I, I, shit, don't think, I think it gets easier though. Oh, when, when it's multiple times. Yeah, when you got three. Uh, there's and now you tell me it's some motions you can make to not use previous cases, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Use, yeah, I know yeah, you're supposed yeah, to, yeah, but yeah. that. Nigga, I know. You know yeah, what yeah what it's virtually impossible. Yeah. If you know, you know. You know what I'm saying? That nigga need to 
Stop fucking focusing on shaking fast. <laughs> I sound like you need to go and put a camera up and be like, hey, you finna be videotaped, we fucking. Sound like they need to put a camera up. Yeah, they need <laughs> Shit, it sound like yeah, they yeah, need to. Yeah, they need, yeah, I think need they the, the ones need the camera. Yeah. Them motherfuckers is, uh, yeah. like, that shit is insane. Yeah, like, insane. to be, I don't know. It's I, I can't imagine it. Like, how do you, that call from jail where you try to be like, man, they got me again, bro. They they lying on me again. You know what I'm saying? Like, come on, bro. Like, it, 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 it can't. It can't be that. Yeah, it, yeah, I don't know. You know what I'm saying? Like, that nigga got shake it, shake it fast yeah. and watch yourself. <laughs> that nigga need to focus on the ladder. <laughs> like, watch yourself, nigga. Like, this nigga, I don't know, man. I, I don't. I don't think you can shoot him no bail on this. What say you? I would have to. I would have to hear all of the. I would have to hear everything. I, I don't like really just passing a, a judgment with no information at all. Google it. I mean, you know, <laughs> it. I, can tell you, I can tell you right now. What no, is it? <laughs> Google it. <laughs> I keep talking while I'm finding you the charge. No, but you know, shit. Hey, like, I I feel like hey, if you if you if you rape somebody and you got to go to jail, I feel like you should be. Hit with the max amount, and I also am a firm believer when women make false allegations of rape, I feel like they should get the same amount of time in jail that a man that she was accusing would get. What can you define as false? Just not being proven? No, false can be that they had consensual sex, mm. woke up with dick regret, and now they're trying to stream rape. But I'm saying, I'm saying from a legal standpoint, because that's what you're talking about. If they should, if they should, if there's plenty of cases of mm -hmm. women being shown that they have lied and made false allegations of rape. And they've messed up a lot of men. Just the mere accusation. How of many rape times has that happened on men that has multiple rape charges? Though? No, we're not talking about. I'm, we're not talking about just the mystical thing. You with oh, okay, multiple, okay. multiple. You know, just that's even. You, you don't. You got Deshaun Watson on the docket. I don't want to jump ahead. No, no. Oh, but even with like Deshaun, you know what I'm saying? These women took money, did what they did, and now that you've done a, a class action suit mm -hmm. because now you you got dick regret. That's all it is. Is dick regret. You, he didn't force himself on you. You did a sexual act for money. He didn't force. You talking about Deshaun Watson? Yes. He didn't force himself. No, they took money for that shit. Oh. They took money. Okay. And they wasn't none of them. Most of them wasn't even professional <laughs> massage therapists. I don't know. I don't. Like I, 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 don't I, I didn't. I, just I haven't seen. I thought it was massage therapy. I mean, no, I haven't was, come seen on, man, that. There's some Instagram. No, no certifice. No certification. <laughs> having you, you come into a man's crib like butt naked. I don't. You that, you putting your I mean come on what man. is that what I mean is coming uh, to his crib butt naked I mean put like this that I, don't, naked. I look at things very simply but I'm you, saying you, you said put, coming to his crib butt naked what is what is what is mean, what that do you mean? Mean? I mean okay this dude is literally he has he literally only gets the personal massage therapist that's coming personally to his crib is they a lot of these women knew each other that's how it became a class action suit. It is. It, there's not. There's You're not no. Making a point, there's, I am making a point that what there's the no. Point? There's no. There's nothing in there saying he forced himself on those women. That's not true. That is true. You not Google that. That's not. That, that's that's reason why, that in the massage that, that, That's the reason why he didn't pay. He paid his civilness, and he spent what? He, they finna hit him with six, six. Uh, what a six game suspension. That's that's not. Which I think is true. But if okay. he if he in, if he innocent, why is he getting hit with a suspension? I mean, if they dropped. Well, off. that's the NFL suspension. You don't have to. You don't have to be found guilty. They can just do it just because it's enough media attention behind something. They can fucking suspend you. They had that right. They're having a massage therapist convention to be held in Cleveland as the sign watch it remains in the news. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's funny. Uh, so, I'm not. What was I looking up? Well, you were supposed to be looking up mystical, then we started talking about this. Yeah, fuck mystical. He's a rapist. Okay. Like, like, I don't, I don't <laughs> have to. I don't have to deal with him. He's a racist. No, nah, he was looking up Deshaun Watson. He was saying that I, if from what I read, I didn't see, I didn't see anything where I seen a couple cases where they were saying that, yeah, he forced himself on him. Now, that it was what was said. So I don't, I don't have any reason not to believe them. Uh, there were instances where he wasn't. He was fully dressed. It was a massage. They are licensed massage therapists. There was a couple of those who, yeah, they're professional massage therapists. Some of them have worked with under other NFL teams, so they weren't all Instagram chicks. They did not know each all know each other. That's not true. There were some that did. I said some. I didn't say every single. But out of twenty two, it may have been like six or seven that knew each other. That's a lot more. That's less than a third. Like I, I he did something. Okay. He didn't do nothing. He ain't innocent. 
You know what I'm saying? But does that, but he he settled 23 of the 24. No, assault. I didn't say he's a rapist, but there's. I mean, you said he forced himself. Assault. You said he forced himself on him. So is, yeah, is that, that's is not that, rape. For, so how did he force himself on him? What, what, if you rub your dick on a woman, that's forcing yourself on a woman, right? You don't. You don't. That's not rape. That's not the same thing as rape. Right. Right, okay. that's sexual assault. Yes, yeah, the okay. sexual assault, and that's what he was accused of. A licensed he wasn't massage accused of therapist who filed the first claim, Watson, in twenty twenty one. Two cases of da 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 da. Both cases, uh, Watson was said in both cases to have pressured women to perform oral sex during the massages, mm-hmm. and was accused and also of have grabbed a woman's buttocks and vagina. The civil that's sexual assault. Okay, well, well, we gonna, so we are gonna skip the, over the, the so, civil suits. So the legs, I'm not skipping over. Bro, I'm, I'm not skipping man. over anything. None of this shit. I mean, these, I mean, these, these are the allegations. The, self, yeah. the civil suit uh, alleged that Watson engaged in a pattern of lewd behavior with women uh, hired to provo- uh, provide personal services, coercing them to touch him. So he coerced them to touch him in a sexual manner, exposing himself. He had uh, hired massages or moving his body in ways that forced them to touch his penis. The incident cited that the suits were uh, said to have occurred uh, between 20 and 24. Yeah. The only thing about this whole thing with him is, I, I, I mean, like you say, you got 23. Yeah, you was doing that shit. He was doing this shit. Yeah, he was doing that shit. Doing shit. Doing you know shit. what I'm saying? It's yeah, like, yeah, now, that that should he, you know what I mean? Like, that, that's what I'm saying. It's like, that sex game shit, like, even when we was shorties, like, niggas that used to, we'd be on the bus, and a nigga, you know, put his hand down, and the girl sit on his hand, or whatever that little, you know, kitty shit we used to do. Right. Even then, it was a possibility, like, she might tell. You know what I'm saying? It was well, always like, yeah, you. like, you know what I'm saying? It's like, so to do it, Without their permission and get off was never yeah, it was never you know what I'm saying it's like ooh I, you know what I'm saying or like the nigga be like I touched the button gym class it's like mm. did she like it like not, not even that you was that mentality of like women out of that but it's like I, y'all go together like yeah you know what mm-hmm. I'm saying it's like did you just take it like you know mm-hmm. what I'm saying so it's like it's that same mentality it's like playing that game as an adult is even crazy you know that what I'm saying even stupid. dummy just to be somewhere with a woman like even in the elevator and just be like liking them liking them stockings you got on like even that. You know what I'm saying? It's kind of like the way I was raised. It's like hey, you, know, you have all the thoughts but they you in want, that, but they but in that the, different world though. That, but okay, like, that pro like that athlete, mean, right, celebrity, yeah, that, that 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 ego, that. and yeah, what yeah. the you know women throwing it like that is yeah, a yeah. some get lost you in find, that shit. Yeah, you find yourself on the outside of the bubble, like because yeah. you, you know your bubble is only this big, mm-hmm. and now you went to the next state over, and people be yeah. like, "Who are you?" You know what I'm saying? You like, bitch, you don't know who I am, big bitch. Tell them who I am. And you know, she's she like, oh, okay, nice to meet you. And you like, I'm a fuck up. You know what yeah, I'm saying? I just don't understand. I, I just don't understand how when you get to like he said, you, when you in it, when you get to a certain level and you got all of this pussy being thrown at you, I don't understand the need to take some pussy. It's like, it's like you got millions of dollars, but I'm finna steal your twenty off the table. But it's, yeah. I, think, <laughs> I, I think it's having what you can't have in yeah. the sense of nine like, times out of ten, or the they expectation. Could have it. Nine they times out of ten, right. they could have it. But it's the expectation like, that everybody's supposed to give it. Yeah. It's that too. Or it's or the, it's the, the what do you mean? You what you mean? Like yeah. she really wants you to date her. Yeah. She really want to. What are you like, talking about? Yeah. To it's like no, it's take that it to the game. You know, you ain't trying to do all that. So you like, all right, yeah, I do that. Come over. You know what mm-hmm. I'm saying? And then she come over. You like, I'm gonna get this pussy. You know what I'm saying? She like, nah, I'm on a three week, three month. You know what I'm saying? Time span with you, and you like, uh, drop them draws. You know what I'm saying? It's like, but that, that even that, that's what I'm saying. Like that goes from a mis a misunderstanding. To allegations of, you know what I'm saying? It's like, why don't you just get that understanding before, you know what I'm saying? It's because you never get it because, especially in them sports, right? Especially football. It's a place where high school, college football is big business, right? You can be a player doing shit. And in certain states, certain schools, you can get away with a lot of shit. A lot of shit gets swept under the rug. A lot of shit just... Go over here. You can go back and look so you at think that. They get spoiled and they think that's how life is. That's exactly yeah. yeah. That's how it is. Especially with football. Somebody always football take care in the, of the South. Yeah. Fall, fan, football in the South. Nah. Like from high school, it's a different world. It's a totally different world. Because there's so many people invested in it. It's politics. Like it moves different things where I'm just saying, go back and look for just that that team that Aaron Hernandez was on. That won that championship with Tim Tebow was the quarterback, and everybody looked past kind of everything that happened on the team. Go back and look at all them players and what happened, yeah, and I what they did that. legally, yeah, 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 and yeah. what the shit that them niggas it's, was it's, on. It's, it's, it's but you had a lot of shit. Yeah, like, you and you, but you had Tim Tebow, who was you know. But it's just like that meme that that uh, I posted super that, Christian virgin. Um, the guy said, uh, well, well a, a girl posted it, and she was like, uh, "I went out with a homeboy of mine." And when we got around people, he introduced me as his girlfriend, and she was shocked. Yeah. She was like, "I, you know, I had what no idea." Yeah. And 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 my thinking, and it's the same thing, goes back to that whole misunderstanding thing, right? 
how can that man be that bold to do that, but not be bold enough to show you he like you? Right. So somebody, you know what I'm saying? The misunderstanding ain't really a. You're not trying to understand it. You know what right. I'm saying? Like I don't. I don't see how that's that's not a, a mousy dude. You know what I'm saying? To just walk up and be like, yeah, that's my lady. Then he's doing other things to show you. You know what I'm saying? So how are you? And I, that so I don't. I don't understand right. that. This what, what say you? Well, I mean, with that, that's more of a subjective, damn near case by case. Because I'm. A, I mean, for the most part, like you say, you got you you. I just look at normal interactions with men and women. I have literally seen men communicate perfectly what they feel and i've watched women take what the man said and interpreted it through their feelings mm -hmm. so it changed everything the fuck that he said yeah and i've also seen women explain how they feel and i've seen niggas just ignore everything that she said and just said hey, well fuck what she's talking yeah, about she don't mean that and yeah you know <laughs> she don't, she don't, she don't like, mean i'm leaving nigga about. like yeah, bitch, all right, going on okay all right you leaving you going to your mom's house you'll mm -hmm. be back so it's like man it's is is Sometimes it's just like it's person by person and some people can interpret and hear and understand what people are saying. And some people, they change everything that they hear to fit what they already, the narrative they already got in their head. So he could be one of those guys to where she explicitly explained, this is nothing but a massage. I'm so what do you tell your guy? Further. When you be like, nah, I think she was serious. He like, that bitch, mm -hmm. <laughs> I mean, we, I guess, at that point, shit, I guess we're going to find out when you keep doing what you're doing. <laughs> you be like, hey, nigga, I, I think you need to... Uh, Come down to my job. Shit, <laughs> right, it's getting to a point to where when you have before you have sex with a woman, you gotta give a damn sexual disclosure and a, uh, agreement. Uh, I think it's love. both ways. Shit, looking at mystical and all it, like all these women things that's going on. It's like you would think on both parties. Like you see the precautions that men take. You see the precautions women take. And so you, when you see those in place, like you'd be like, oh, that was smart. I could see how they did that. That, was, mm -hmm. that boy, that boy got him signed an NDA, like all that. <laughs> shit. But then when you see people that don't do it, it's like, what you're the, stupid. How? how why you didn't know what you I'm saying? That? Like you saw this shit happen over here. Yeah, like how y'all yeah, not playing that game? That? Like, yeah. I mean, but that's just like how these some of these rich dudes are still stupid and not making women sign prenuptials, and then they get mad when they get railroaded after the divorce. It's like you see what's the smart thing to do. Everybody, every man and every woman does not take the proper precautions. I see men put themselves in precarious situations. I've seen women put themselves in precarious situations. You, we are adults. We should know better. We know what we shouldn't be doing. And then we'll go and we'll still fucking do it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, I, I, I think it's interesting to just to see, like, like you saying, with the debate and how people go back and forth and, and putting their own preferences out to people. You know what I'm saying? It's like you'll ask a general question, like, and then you'll see there, you know, it's like, what you like, red or black? Well, I'm going to tell you, you know, and then they tell you a whole personal story. Like, I had a friend that was red, and then, you know what I'm saying? Be like, nigga. Like, then by the end of it, they're going to be like, oh, just to answer your question, green. Yeah. Right, right. <laughs> like, why are we only choosing from those two colors? Right, That's right. a binary thing. Um, well, um, did y'all hear about that, uh, <laughs> the 18 year old that was. First of all, it was an 18-year-old working security at Lollapalooza. Uh, the bomb threat dude? It was a girl. Just to get, it was a girl? I it thought it was girl. Uh, it, That just seemed like just something to, to do with you. Just to get the fuck off work. Wow. Yeah, she you called you couldn't in. call in sick? You, you said, couldn't call in? No, it was a mass shooting threat, actually. And then it was, uh, she said that her, her a family member called her and was like, did you see Facebook? It's a Facebook page where a man said he going to. And so her boss was like, show me the Facebook page. This young lady went and made a Facebook page from her phone and said, mass shooting today at 6 o'clock. And then it was like, look, they did an IP, Apple thing, and it was like, this you, though. <laughs> it was like, yeah, you off. Man, that dick, yeah. that dick appointment must have been pretty important. Could have been a, a vagina appointment. Oh, well, shit, yeah, sometimes, you know, I can't, can't assume what so people sometimes like Sometimes these no ladies be turning these ladies out. Like, they no, what's even crazy? What if she just wanted to go to Lala? Right. You would have been there. <laughs> That's what I'm Where saying. It's different. No, no, no. She want to be in the crowd with her friends, yeah, get high, like do all that shit. That. I'd, have been, I'd have been securing my friends. <laughs> that right. Been, that yeah. been, that the dead crazy. prayers. Yeah. My friends, nigga. Wow. That's crazy. Uh, Breonna Taylor brought up on federal charges. Brianna I mean, Taylor. Damn, I'm about to say Brianna, Brianna Taylor, Taylor yeah. officers. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I've seen the four, the four officers arrested. Yeah, yeah congratulations. Yeah, yeah. That's yeah, good. That. That's, it's always good yeah, when when these these fucking murderers are actually prosecuted. And it's fed charges, so you know how they move. Yeah, mm -hmm. they uh, they got that uh, uh, Derek Chauvin. They brought him up. On, or, or I think, the, I, I, no, not not Chauvin. He was already he he done. He doing his time. The uh, big the big shit that um George Floyd. 
Was that, oh, that was the show. show. That yeah, is the yeah, show. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was thinking about um, the uh, Laquan McDonald, that, that that officer. But uh, yeah, Chauvin, they they doing him on federal charges too. So, I mean, I just, I hope they don't beat this shit. But what y'all think about that? I'm happy. I mean, shit. At least at least on the federal level, you have a a, a better chance of of a, of a proper uh, prosecution. As opposed to if it was on the, the lower level, you know, mm-hmm. then they then they get them little slaps on the fucking wrist. It's you like, think she gonna have more uh more rights than a building <laughs> than she did? Like the state said, the building basically has more rights than you because the building was the only thing that the officer got charged for shooting at or the hitting. Building? Yeah. Holy fuck! He got charged for discharging a weapon into <laughs> an <laughs> occupied building, and oh, they didn't okay. give no charges for shooting her. Wow. So on the state level, she doesn't have as much right as a, as a building. fucking building. So on the federal level, do y'all think she would have more rights than a building? I'm it's, hoping it's, so. It's, it's, <laughs> it's up in the air, though. That's what but, I'm saying. It's literally a question that you the, don't know. It's the feds, bro. The feds don't bring cases unless they, unless they can win. <laughs> like, yeah. that's just their move is to get you to settle. Yep. Right, yep. so they can keep their shit at 98. I know. I, when I, we were shorties, it was 99. I wonder what, what got them to What 90. dropped it? Yeah, yeah right. who knows? They probably they probably kept retrying that motherfucker. Like, <laughs> um, <laughs> like nigga, hung jury, do it again. All right. Um, Brittany Griner. <laughs> <laughs> what does she got? Like what? Nine and a half, eight and a half years. Nine and a half. Nine and a half. That's such a delicate subject for so many people. I think she had to get down. So you know, I personally, I don't think nine is bad. I mean. I you can't it. trade an arms dealer for a six month sentence. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? If they gave a whatever the regular vape shit that we expect her to get three months, ninety days, even a year, they're gonna be like, You finna trade the merchant of death <laughs> but for a, you let that bitch sit for again, a year. I don't like nobody's who knows that. what Russian law is dictates and dictates. It. That's you, a, would've, you would've known that though. Like but she's when, she's been it, overseas many times. But we know like in, in like Dubai. Like we mm-hmm. know how weed is in Dubai. So yeah. you expect like if you get caught, you you know people are being like she could face up to 20, 30 years. Like you know that in Dubai, they wasn't never saying that. You know what I'm saying all oh, while she was doing the trial, they was just like, damn a vape cartridge, damn a vape cartridge, damn a vape cartridge. Like all Russians do vapes. You know what I'm saying? We understand in Dubai that's a no no. You know what I'm saying? She even had it before in Russia. It was just the fact of at the airport. It's not like it's like in Dubai. It's, you can't have it at all. Right. I get it. You know what I'm saying? But so the nine years, I think. It's crazy, but like I said, I think they had to do that because you're trading who you're trading, so you can't be, you know, you can't do that for a year. Yeah, that's true. I, don't, I just want to know if it was if it was a if it was a guy we'd be hearing all of this uproar. Like yeah, I think we hear more. We we we. I mean, cause it, plus, I mean, with the with the way certain stuff is going, that political climate to be an American citizen is not a good time to get in trouble in fucking Russia. If you <laughs> are Brittany Griner's significant other, you moving to Russia. You going over there for the next nine years? Or you just waiting on the U.S. to? to Man, to, most of the women. Hey, who's, 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 like waiting, who's waking nine years for anybody? I is right, man. Somebody's you fucking somebody while that motherfucker's in jail. Nine years? Yeah, you. A, hey, God bless yeah. you. God bless you. That's your. And point. the only way I would wait, the only way I would ever wait on anybody that went to jail, is that you went to jail in defense of our family, or me. Then you that that's now that I would you deserve my loyalty. To go to jail for whatever dumbass reasons, not just her, but anybody that's going to jail for some dumbass reasons, why the fuck should I continue to wait years? So you're breaking up with her? Yeah, but shit, or you, yes. Are you going, so you're going to tell her you're breaking up with her, or are you going to lie to her? I mean, and be like, yeah, I'm, no, I'm faithful, I'm taking no, care of the kids I, and that, everything. That's not right. I, I feel like you should that you should be transparent as fuck. Hey, like, this ain't going to work. It, this is not going to work. I, I can't even do a long-distance relationship, let alone... Uh, I'm so would you have broke up with her before she got sentenced while she's trying to no, figure I'm it out? No, I'm gonna wait. No, I'm gonna wait to see what because happens. That was what? That was about eight months, nine months. Nine, no, I'm gonna wait. I will wait until we find out. But as that shit is starting to get close to, hey, you, you get even charged. if she's a breadwinner like that, she got all the money. I mean, you don't give fuck fuck pussy, pussy. I need some pussy. Man, like, I that. need some loving in the face. Fuck that. Nine years. Nine years. But what if you you know the U.S. is bringing her back? You just like you ain't gonna wait the year to see like U.S. is slow. You ain't gonna wait for them to drag their feet. Yeah, I'm gonna be like, look, man, if I don't, if I don't hear something in a few months, man, uh, <laughs> I got the bitches calling yeah, me shit, right I now. mean, hey. I mean, even I might not even be fucking with nobody, but I ain't finna, going outside. I ain't finna, I ain't finna be. I mean, my heart ain't finna just be waiting on your ass. You ain't taking all them calls from Russia. Yeah, fuck that, man. <laughs> shit, I, I don't know what the man. I barely want to answer the call from the <laughs> Department of Corrections <laughs> right. in America. Right, man, right. you know what type of charges that shit yeah. is from Russia? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. you definitely got to pay for it. 
What about you, Amaya? You moving to Russia? Naomi get locked up in Russia? Yeah, uh, they're yeah. doing some lawyer I, job, pro I, bono I, I, shit. I'd had to because we got the kids, but then I'd be cautious just because maybe not Russia, someplace close and come visit. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, no, nah, because who knows what they're going to be on to Russia with us? Nah, like, like, you can't you leave. Yeah, right. Yeah, nah. Mm, mm, mm. You going to the prison to visit her? Yeah. You going to the prison to visit your girl? We broke up already. Right. <laughs> yeah. like, what are you going to miss it, bro? Yeah, I'm going to, I'm going to the prison. Bro. You ain't gonna go tell her face to face. This ain't hey, working. Hey, and now, 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 I will, I will, I will put this little avocado on it. I don't know how Russia is now. If we can get some conjugal gift visits. Black like, people is the shit in Russia. Yeah. Yeah. Apparently not. She can get nine years for the vape shit. True. <laughs> yeah, 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 but we can get some conjugal visits. But Roy, Roy Jones is the man over there. They should have hollered at him actually. He is like very good friends with Putin. Shit, maybe they should have sent Rodney. They got over a statue there. of that nigga over there. Of right. Roy Jones. Yeah. Wow, and now that yeah. I didn't know. Yeah. So they yeah. like they like they box. It's like, yeah, they, oh yeah, they, you know, they that hand to hand combat. They they they, they, they treat shit. him like mm. China treats Stefan Marbury. But I didn't even know China gave a fuck about Stefan Marbury. Are you oh serious? My God. I said No, no, no. I'm not I'm not educated on everything. That nigga is he he went over there and found so much like Michael Jackson. Yeah. He over is, there, he is the man. He's over the there. man in China. Over there. In yeah. China, they love him. He love got him. statues, gems named. Yeah, he got him. a bunch of MVPs, he, championships. I mean, it's China, but yeah, they, they just love give him. him shit. Like, yeah, they love him. That nigga, yeah, he's just drowning in Chinese pussy. Yeah, well, have you look at it that way, or 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 Chinese dick? I'm old. Yeah, I've been say, look, at this, his, his age is showing. Even you need to. I need to stretch. You need to call Deshaun. Nigga, I'm just call, sore, nigga. Call, yeah. call Deshaun Watson and, and ask for one of his massage therapists. Yeah, I do. I need it, man. I need keep, to fucking keep, stretch keep, out. Keep your penis to a, the opposite side, side of it, though. You don't want to. Yeah, keep the towel <laughs> over. That little bullshit towel they give you. <laughs> they give you a whole face towel to cover your yeah, joint. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I wonder if they get black men different towels than they get white men. <laughs> that was racist. <laughs> they sure do. They get the cheapest ones they can find. That's probably why Deshaun. He like y'all gave me this. Y'all trying to see my shit. I know what y'all trying to do. They like no sir. This is the towel. That's the standard towel. Um, I wanted to ask you about Will Smith apology. We talked about it last week, so I just wanted to get your uh, take on it real quick. Did you think it was? Uh, I guess I. I just asked you. Too I feel like it's too little, too late. Okay, too little, too late. I feel like it's too little, too do you, late. Do you think it was uh, genuine? I would, I would, I would honestly just because I, of course, I don't know Will Smith personally, but you know how you feel when you, you know, certain celebrities. You've been watching them for years. You see what type of character they got. I would honestly think that it, it's mostly genuine, but also uh, damage control. But I would, I would, I would go with the majority of it is uh, genuine. Yeah, so but say, still, like seventy five, twenty five. Yeah, but still too little, too late. Because by, by then, now Chris is like, man, fuck your apology. Yeah, I'm going to get paid over this. Yeah, he's lucky that he just didn't immediately file a civil suit, so. Yeah, um, yeah I, didn't, I, didn't, I didn't like how it was set up. That's what I was telling them last week. I didn't think that, like how he had a. Uh, Somebody can ask him questions? Yeah, he was asking yeah, him questions. It was so an it's interview like, apology. If they didn't ask you that, you wouldn't have talked about it? What was you there to talk about? Like, come on, guys. Like, let's like yeah. not act like he wasn't there to talk about that. He was probably trying to make it not seem like a speech. But he should have already had been reached out. He should have been reached out to Chris personally. I would have reached out to him regardless of what Chris's response was. And eventually they're gonna let it be known that you don't, you know, you you tried to apologize. Now he didn't accept it. I was bogus. Cool. But you What's to say that he didn't? There's some, he said he did. Chris's family said he did. Tony Rock has joked about it. Like, hell no, you don't hear your apology. We ain't got nothing to say to you. Like he like he's well, he, tried to reach he tried to he tried to apologize to him that night. And he didn't want to see him. He didn't want to be around him. Or he had dipped out, something like that. And then he, there's word he did try. Because like I said, Tony Rock was just, you know what I'm saying, joking about that shit, saying like, nah, fuck your apology, fuck your apology nigga. I didn't, I mean, when he said that, I, you know, I, I fucked up my relationship. Because last week when we talked about that's what I'm talking about again. Because last week we talked about it, I just heard it. The snippets of it. I listened to the whole thing this week, you know, from beginning to end. And um, it was some of the shit they didn't play. Like when he was talking about Tony Rock and how he fucked up his relationship with Tony Rock. And he was like, I never... Repair that. Will Smith had a TV show that Tony Rock was on. Yeah, and I I, I had forgot about that yeah. when he was saying that that Tony. What, what show was that? It was like it was with Dwayne all Martin, all of us, or something like that. All, all of us. It was kind of like, like loosely that. based on him because he had the son and his new girl, and that's when they said like him this. and Dwayne yeah. Martin got close. That whole little rumor started. Yeah. Do y'all think that if if 
do y'all think that if when he accepted that that award, if he immediately apologized? Oh, then yeah, then he I should. Think I, I, even, even if Chris still wouldn't have accepted. Yeah, it, I think the pressure would have been on Chris. He, yeah, it, because everybody would have. Chris couldn't have been as mad because people would be like, he he said sorry. You know what I'm saying? Like mm-hmm. you'd have had those people, like people that was such a fan of Will and such a champion of him, they were still trying to say it was fake. Like the night of, people, you know, you know, it, it grew. But like, as soon as it happened, people thought it was part of a skit. You know, it had cut to commercial. So if it came back with, I'm sorry about that, guys, da 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 da, then it just went up and came back down. Well, but that mean? shit went up and stayed up for like mm-hmm. a week. Well, you know why, what I'm saying? I say like three you, days. How could you not assume that was fake? And that shit was on a, like, I mean, the other Will part Smith? was the fact that it was on a Sunday. And so everybody went to work Monday talking about it. That was the only thing. And so Monday, Tuesday, it really didn't die. You know what I'm saying? It, nope. it, it lived. It, if it would have happened on a Friday and then it'd be like, what happened Friday? Like, I ain't left mm-hmm. work early. I ain't, I, you know what I'm saying? I had to get the kids, whatever. That shit lived so long and he didn't, he didn't put the ball back in. Everybody was like, what, where's Will? Where's Will? Let's talk mm-hmm. to Will. And then he showed him partying that night. Like, he don't give yeah, a fuck. And, you know what I'm saying? So with, if he, With if his toxic ass female. Why do you feel the responsibility to hold women accountable? Why do I feel the responsibility to hold women right accountable? I'm going to stretch, man. Okay. We can take a break. Okay. We'll be back after a boo-boo session. No, I just feel you stretch. <laughs> My fucking leg, cramp and shit. Yeah, but I definitely want to address that. I love that question. <laughs>